Hey, uh, <laughs> you're back. <laughs> you like watching me. You like looking at me. I know, I know. <laughs> I get it. I completely understand. Uh, thank you for coming back and joining me. It's another story time up in this bee. <laughs> The real question is why am I so weird? Such a valid question. I don't know. Let's start this story time here now. Uh, okay. Hello, what's up? How you doing? Is everybody aight? You know? <laughs> what? I don't even understand where this burst of energy is coming from. But I'm really thankful that you guys have come to join us. By the way, if you see that my hair is looking white, I literally just washed it and it's refusing to dry. And I don't have the patience to chill for it to dry. So it's just, I don't understand. Like, you're short. I don't know why you're taking so long to dry. Whatever. That's an issue for another day. Anyway, today I have this story time about the second time that I... I'm sure if you see Sorry. I know there's a second or a third time. It's either one of them. Second or third time that I snuck out and went out to the club. And this time we got out, we snuck out of my place, my parents' house. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm only saying this story now because I'm not in my parents' house. As you can see, I'm really in university right now. And this is years later. So it's like I can't really be crucified for something that I did way back when. You know what I'm saying? So it's cool. Even if they watch it now, it's all right. I hope. Because uh, <laughs> I'm eventually going to go back home. And hopefully no one like no i don't think we would would they actually i'm not sure but i'll just keep you posted if one day you just see that i, I don't know so we'll, we'll find out we'll find out that's our future who are kind of problem anyway so this was back in high school as usual uh <laughs> your girl was really not the best in high school but it's okay everyone has a pass let's move on swiftly so this was in high school i think it was in ib it was in ib1 ib1 basically is like a levels a lot fucking harder let me not lie to you if anyone who's done ib you can connect with me because ib is really not a joke it's like pre basically it's like you're in uni but not really in uni it was a lot of work so please i was allowed to like let out the stress that i'm feeling inside in a nightclub you know what i'm saying and i think at this time i was probably was I 17 or 18 honestly i'm not sure i think i was probably i was 17 because i didn't have an id yeah i was 17 and it was my really close friend and i we we're gonna name her charity so this um it was a random weekend it was like there was no celebration there was no at event or anything it was just we're just talking about with charity about going out sometime and she'd been out more times than me so she was experienced in terms of going to the club and everything i wasn't on the other hand i really wasn't i think this was probably like the fourth or fifth time i'd been out i swear it's like i'm going through puberty again so this was like in april and or end of like march there of ib1 and we were we wanted to go out for this a random like night out and i was like yeah the usual you know the usual drill sleepover she comes to mine and then we can sneak out and and now i had even like done my logistics for how we're gonna sneak out so i'm like you just come to mine we'll just say we are studying the whole week i was like yeah 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 charity and i are going out no <laughs> yeah the club we'll be dancing and everything yeah oh you guys are not going out no oh you've not been out in a while no us we're going this weekend Oh, we can, we'll probably check it out. We'll see. We'll have that. We'll just see how our schedule is. But that's for going out. Now, me, it was my turn to now sort, of, sort out the logistics on my end. That whole week, I was just walking around the house, looking, looking through, like, which door we can get out from. And I said, Sawa, the sitting room is the best because we can be watching TV, acting like we're watching TV, and then just sneak out. We just won't go upstairs. So it's so much easier. We'll just come downstairs in our gowns, put our gowns, like, because there's a guest room as well, like, just downstairs. So I'm like, we'll come downstairs in our gowns, wear, like, our clothes under, and then I'll just need to get the keys for the this back door. So I took these keys because they used to be on their room, like on the dresser. And I'm like, cool, we have the keys to sneak out. Now my friend comes on Friday. And that night, I don't think, my mom wasn't coming home. So it was only my dad. Advantage number one, because I know my dad's not going to disturb us. Actually coming to the room to check on us. So Loki, I was like, thank you, God. But I know it's not God because God doesn't want me to go out. But thank you, guardian angel. Cool. So we start showering and getting ready. Let's say like out seven or eight we get ready and then we wear our gowns so we had like our clothes under and then we had like our gowns on top and for the rest of the night we we're just chilling we we're waiting for my dad to come and then he can sleep so i think my dad came like at eight eight thirty 
This guy took so long to go to bed. He took so bloody long. I remember we were just watching TV and the whole time, because I was getting anxious. I'm like, I want to go. Tonight is my night. So now it's mission getting out of the house. Alrighty, let's do this. So it's opening that um, a sitting room door. Mind you, let's backtrack it. Go. I would open the sitting room door because I know it makes noise when you open. Because it's the metal grill doors. Then you know the metal ones. Once you do this, we are. They, I don't know why they exaggerate so much. So I'm like, I know at night I can't open it. So let me just leave it open. So night was just literally opening the door and pushing the door. First things first. I don't know why I forgot I had dogs, but I have dogs. Two. Were they three then? Rest in peace. I think there were two. There were two of them. Because they are so excited to see me and they don't see me at that time of the night. These bitches were they actually bitches because one's a bitch, so I'm not These bitches were barking. Ah! Hold up! Sorry, my bad, my bad. This story time is really bad. But before and we had walked to my dogs and I told like because I wanted uh charity. I wanted the dogs to be familiar with charity. So I'm like, let's go outside and you chill with the dogs. Aki, we had thought through this plan. No pothole. So I'm like, let's go chill outside with the dogs. So these dogs, I don't know, they don't attack. I know they won't attack you, but let them just be familiar with you. So when we chuck, they are not surprised at you who's this. So I remember even when we got home um she went and we went and we just like we chilled with the dogs to let, let your cassette like smell them whatever whatever now fast forward to now saturday i mean friday night and now we are outside we're in the city room we've called our taxi guy we've given him the directions to our place and now he's outside and we told him don't hoot mother i'm like don't hoot or enter the drive through you just cap or you like stay up there don't hoot because they have like a driveway like this guy psh, i dare you to hoot i dare you to even come down the driveway so we enter the car, taxi cab and now uh, we're going now charity is honestly mad i don't know why but she's really funny but now when we enter the taxi she's like let's pray i was like oh <laughs> are we about to pray before we sin that's what we're doing we are praying whilst we sin actually whilst in the midst of us sinning we're here about to pray that you forgot to see us through the night you know what god have mercy you know god is not like a human being so let's just sour let's pray dear god dear god pray that you keep us safe tonight that you keep us safe tonight we're sorry that we snuck out to go out but we're just a bit stressed and we just want to have a good time so please cover us with the precious blood of your son jesus christ oh um okay uh yeah we went out to Electric Avenue. I'm not sure if it's still called Electric Avenue. Charity was in shorts and a crop top. Me, I was in a skirt, a short, obviously a short skirt and a crop top. And I feel like we are the only ones who are like overdressed. Not everyone was dressed like that because I, I don't know that everyone is just used to going out. They don't feel a big deal. But we were honestly like out there. Me, my skirt was luminous pink. So it can even be seen like in the dance floor or whatever. It was bright like <laughs> most our time we spent in Molly's just we were just dancing honestly it felt like a workout we were honestly just dancing and we're dancing and we were dancing and we loved the attention listen there's a way you can dance and there's a way people will look at you and you'll just feel happy so I guess that's what was Mara me I was feeling motivated I was feeling so motivated because that I don't know. But the more I dance and the more people are looking at me, ah, I would even arc my back and dance in Monte Kitano, pick it up slow. I think this is when I started learning that you don't really have to grind with people that you don't want to. Because charity, like when, remember when we were dancing, remember, like from my, if you've not seen my first, my ever, my first ever story time when I talked about like how I didn't know that people, you're not supposed to grind with people so now this is like the fourth fifth time i'm going out and the, my first time going out is charity and that's when she's i started learning that you don't have to grind with everyone because i remember some guys would come and dance with me and we are dancing because i'm like i have to dance with him i dance then he goes and i'm like oh thank god and charity would come like i why were you dancing with him oh, he's an orb and i was like yeah i know but see you want to dance with me and she's like why are you dancing with him if you don't want to so even her when she was dancing and guys would come you know she'd literally stop dancing and just push him away like please ain't nobody and i was just watching her like wow oh my gosh charity is such goals i was now like 5 or 6 30 6 like maybe 5 5 30 ish it's a good time to leave 
So I'm like, yeah, we need to start going and call the cab. At this point, Charity lets me know that we don't have any money. And I live far. Uh, I live quite a distance away from... <laughs> I actually live far. Yeah. So, hmm, hmm, ha. Hey, girl, uh, what are we going to do? So it's either we are calling one of our parents. Second of all, we went out without our phones. But stupidity stupidity is also our middle name you know we went out without our phones so we don't have a phone we're two of us here in westlands i need to go home do you know where i live yeah i live in runda that is i need a thousand bob to go home i need at least a thousand bob to go home and we do not have a thousand bob so it's either we're going to start becoming strippers here and now in the streets and people are going to pay us money or we call get someone borrow their phone and call one of our parents I don't know again this i don't say it's god because i don't know i feel like i'm abusing him but both our guardian angels were just looking out for us and this guy her friend gave her a g because people now are leaving and guys are just asking oh yeah by the way how are you getting home okay kenyan guys they're actually you're actually sweet like you guys can actually be sweet i think just in that part the other parts i'm really not sure but that part you can really be sweet so guys are obviously asking like yeah how are you getting home and swans of <laughs> That's a lovely question because even we don't know how we're getting home. You are you or oh, you're driving? Oh, uh, so enter the taxi. <sighs> Guess who decides? We tell the taxi guy where we're going. Guess who decides to sleep? <laughs> I mean, let me tell you why sleeping was not a good idea. Charity doesn't know where I live. Like, she can't direct you. Now she can, but then this was her first time. She couldn't direct you to where I live. I'm the only one in that car would have told you where I live. He eventually gets us like to my house and I'm like don't enter through the drive through but just park somewhere there and then we'll just walk down. Now as we're walking down, guess which animals see us and start barking again. My dogs! Yes, my dogs were barking at the gate and were the ones walking down. Like it could wow. The Ascari opens for us the gate and then we enter now back through the sitting room opening that door quietly because you know i told you it's the metal doors you know the doors that do like you just open a bit and <laughs> making so much noise so we're opening slowly and we enter i lock the door and it's time to go upstairs to my room listen the wood in that house was making so much noise i'm talking like we're going like <laughs> me i'm drunk so i'm like the whole time we're walking up the stairs chai Chu was like because i'm hearing the noise but it's like it's not registering so i just i'm just ignoring it we shut the door and now we entered my room and went to my room so it's time to change yeah <laughs> we're changing we're changing i'm chucking my toe i chuck my top i chuck my skirt i chuck my bra and i just keep in Coins were falling, money was just falling, lip glosses, lip balm, because I'd hidden. I didn't come out with a purse, so everything just fell in one big on the tile, not even on the wood or the carpet, because I was in my bathroom. Loud. And my room is next to my parents' room. And I just had Chai who was just like. I was so tired that next day, but it was all worth it because the pictures we posted on Instagram were just phantom gorgeous that's the only thing i was talking about for a very long time even like months later so and so yeah that time when we had gone out with charity you know this guy yeah i met him is he the one that we met that time when we went out oh he's not the one oh it's the friend oh no he's the one that we met that time with the white top anyways thank you very much for watching this video i hope that you enjoyed it um smile share and subscribe follow me on instagram twitter and snapchat subscribe don't be shy subscribe to this channel and i'll be making another video next week thank you very much sayonars bye My name is Wahura Kabutha, I'm Marula. Well, my name is Wanda, I'm Marula. Wahura Kabutha, I'm Marula. Subscribe for free, I'm Marula. You can also share, I'm Marula. Don't be shy, I'm Marula. Wahura Kabutha, I'm Marula. Hey! I'm also a composer. Uh, I know what you're thinking. Damn, this chick is talented. I am. I am. But I'm humble. So, it's cool. Be easy. The rocks.